The aviation industry is facing significant challenges due to ongoing issues with the Pratt & Whitney PW1000G engine, which powers several popular Airbus aircraft. These problems are causing major disruptions for airlines and passengers alike. We will address these engine problems a bit later. Swiss International Airlines is particularly affected by this situation. The airline expects up to 14 of their Airbus A220, A320neo, and A321neo aircraft to be grounded due to PW1000G engine issues. According to Swiss Chief Operating Officer Oliver Buchhofer, this grounding could last until 2026, significantly impacting the airline's operations. This problem isn't new for Swiss. The airline has been in discussions with Pratt & Whitney about the engine issues for some time, though there's no word yet on potential compensation. The impact on Swiss's operations is already evident, with several of their planes currently parked in Zurich due to these engine problems. To maintain their flight schedule, Swiss is relying heavily on wet-leased aircraft from other airlines such as Air Baltic and Helvetic Airways. The PW1000G engine issues are affecting other airlines as well. Cyprus Airways, for instance, has scrapped their plans to purchase Airbus A220s entirely because of these problems. The airline CEO cited the engine issues as a significant factor hurting their profitability and forcing a reconsideration of their fleet strategy. As a result, Cyprus Airways will continue operating A320s until the A220 engine problems are reportedly resolved by 2027. So what are these engine problems? The exact details of the problem with the Pratt & Whitney PW1000G engines powering Airbus A220, A320neo, and A321neo aircraft haven't been publicly disclosed. However, based on the information available, we can make some educated guesses about the potential issues affecting these engines. One possible problem could be contamination. Earlier issues with the PW1000G involved contamination in powdered metal components used in the engine. This contamination could lead to cracks in crucial parts like the high-pressure turbine discs, potentially causing engine failure. While this issue might have been addressed in newer engines, it's possible there are lingering concerns or related problems that have emerged. Another potential issue relates to durability. Reports suggest the engines might not be as durable as originally expected. This could mean more frequent maintenance needs and potentially shorter lifespans compared to what airlines were hoping for, leading to increased operational costs and reduced aircraft availability. There might also be issues with engine performance that haven't been specified. This could include limitations on thrust power, leading to restrictions on certain routes or payload capacity, which would significantly impact airlines' operational flexibility. It's difficult to know the exact nature of the problems for several reasons. Engine manufacturers often keep specific details about technical problems confidential for competitive reasons. Additionally, the focus might be on finding solutions and ensuring safety rather than publicly dissecting the exact nature of the problem. What we do know is that these problems are causing significant disruptions for airlines. Planes are being grounded, repairs are time-consuming, and airlines are forced to lease replacements at additional costs. The problems are expected to persist for some time, with estimates ranging from 2026 to 2027 for a complete resolution. This situation underscores the complexity of modern jet engines and the far-reaching impacts that technical issues can have on the aviation industry. As airlines, manufacturers, and regulators work to address these problems, the industry will be closely watching for updates and solutions. The industry is now watching closely to see how Pratt & Whitney will address these issues and how long it will take to get the affected aircraft back in service. In the face of this uncertainty, airlines like Swiss and potentially others will need to adapt their strategies to ensure they can continue serving their passengers. Do you think Along with Boeing troubles, this incident too shows that the American manufacturers are losing their edge in technology. We bring you some good information on aerospace. Please like and share the video and subscribe the channel.